The Rainforest Rangers invite you to learn about butterflies. Butterflies are among the most beautiful and marvelous creatures in all of nature. Costa Rica is the richest region in the world for butterflies and has over 1,300 species. Butterflies have three pairs of legs and three body parts, the head, the thorax, and the abdomen. In addition, they have two pairs of wings, the forewings and the hindwings, which are covered with scales. The scales reflect light, revealing the patterns and colors of the species. A butterfly's proboscis is its tongue, enabling it to suck up food, nutrients, and moisture. It is hollow and contains two parallel tubes with the end bearing the taste sensors. Butterflies and all other insects have both a brain and a heart. The center of a butterfly's nervous system is located in the insect's thorax, not its head. The butterfly has a long chambered heart that runs the length of its body on the upper side. The heart pumps hemolymph from the rear of the insect forward to bathe its internal organs. It has other functions similar to our blood. Butterflies pass through four stages of development throughout their life cycle. The egg, the larvae, the pupa, and the adult. The two stages in which they are visibly active are the larvae and the adult. A caterpillar is the larval stage of butterflies and moths. Seven to ten days after the tiny eggs are produced, the caterpillar hatches. During the next seven to ten days, the caterpillars eat almost constantly and grow very quickly at an astonishing rate. When larval growth is done, the caterpillar stops eating and empties its digestive system. It then looks for a sheltered, safe spot where it will turn into a pupa, entering its third stage of its metamorphosis. The pupa stage lasts from two weeks to a month, at which time the butterfly emerges from its shell. The job for an adult butterfly is to mate and reproduce. The males look for females to inseminate. The females lay tiny eggs. Most eggs are attached to the plant with a fast drying glue like chemical that the female secretes along with the egg. A typical female butterfly will lay about 100 eggs in her lifetime. Some species lay their eggs gregariously, which means in clusters. Other species lay their eggs individually. One species lays eggs while flying. Of the hundred or so eggs that may be laid, only 2% should be expected to survive to become healthy and reproductive adult butterflies. Butterflies are fragile and almost defenseless creatures. In the wild, they have an incredibly high mortality rate of around 98%. This is because they are eaten by a very large number of predators. Their predators include birds, spiders, reptiles, small mammals, and other insects, such as wasps, flies, and mites. Most butterflies protect themselves from predators by using camouflage. Some butterflies blend into their environment so well that it is almost impossible to spot them when they are resting on a branch. Some butterflies look like dead leaves, while others look like the bark of a tree. Butterflies are poisonous. When a predator, like a bird, eats one of these butterflies, it becomes sick, vomits violently, and quickly learns not to eat this type of butterfly. The sacrifice of one butterfly will save the lives of many of its kind. Mimicry is when two unrelated species have similar markings. Since many predators have become sick from eating the poisonous butterfly, they will avoid any similar looking animals in the future and the mimic is protected. Flying is a major defense of butterflies. The speed varies among butterfly species. The poisonous varieties are slower than the non-poisonous varieties. Fastest butterflies can fly at about 30 miles per hour or faster. Slow flying butterflies fly about five miles per hour. Like all other living organisms, which we classify as wildlife, butterflies are very dependent on certain types of plants and habitats in order to survive. 
Plants depend on butterflies to help in the pollination process. Since butterflies have very close relationships with their host plants, the protecting of plants and natural habitats in the wild is essential for their survival. In order to conserve butterflies, we must also conserve their habitat. No moth or butterfly eats solid food, though some butterflies drink nectar. Some cannot even take in moisture. The color in a butterfly's wings does not come from pigment. Rather, the color is produced prism-like with light reflecting from the transparent wing scales. Butterflies seem to prefer pink, red, and purple flowers. The pair of antennae on the head is the primary sense organ of a butterfly. Newly emerged or fresh butterflies can have brighter colors, while older ones may be faded. Males and females of the same species can look entirely different. Butterflies are daytime flyers, while moths fly mostly at night. Butterflies can see red, green, and yellow 